Warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for, for little sissy bitches. So, viewer discretion is advised. We kill shit here. Trapper J Outdoors is sponsored by Duke Traps Wildlife Management Equipment. Dunlap Lures Results Matter and RBG Traps. Everyone needs a round body grip trap. Welcome back. Today we are going to catch some quail. We are going to kill some quail. And then we are going to, my wife is going to bake them. Looks like some kind of bacon wrap, applewood bacon wrap and, and in the oven. Stuff them. So at the moment it's uh, who's getting turned into a sandwich. Who will be turned into a sandwich? Is it the first ones that come up to me and I grab a hold of them? Possibly. They don't know what kind of game they're playing. I can't find my net. I used it on that bow fishing thing. I may have left it at Allegedly's boat. Allegedly, did I leave my net in your boat? Okay, here we go. I'm just going to go in and find out who's coming out with me. I got my favorites, so I know there's some that won't come out. Tell me, hey dummy, you need water. We need water, dummy. Who's gonna get it? That's a male. It's a male. The Bob White one to come by here. These are my favorites. Can't off them. This guy. Sorry, little buddy. You've become dinner. Cute little sucker, though. One. It's a big quail too. <clears throat> Number two. Well, it's leaving. It's out of here. When I was a kid, we were really freaked out about uh, um, my grandpa would just pull the heads off of the chickens and then let them go. Oh man, we didn't know what the hell was happening. Okay, need someone else. One more. And these are my favorites right here, so. I see my victim.
All right, there's my four. I gotta get these guys some water real quick and then get back with the video. All right, here's our little work table for the moment. Don't have to be anything special because you're gonna wash them and all that anyways. These things work. There we go. Brand new. Never used them. I will save all the feathers for trapping season. This little area of pin feathers is new to me. You don't see this on Bob White's. Even though I pulled the skin off, it's still there. They come over and rinse them all off after this so there's one you just repeat put all the feathers in the bag and move on my bag of feathers i'll put in the freezer be for putting them in my sets bobcats and whatnot Get these guys washed up and move on to the next part. Stay tuned. Yeah, that goes in. This a is just a quick, quail. easy quail recipe. What's all going in it? Well, it's gonna have stove stove top stuffing, and then dried cranberries and apples, chunks in the stove top. And then we're going to stuff it inside the quail. Mm 
and have a sweet, delicious stuffed quail. Right, Libby? Yeah. Just you want to give me the lemon juice out of the refrigerator? Too much light. I think it's plenty of apple. Something on there. Oh, the white. Look at the ref white reflecting off, off your countertop. Oh, geez. We have the new countertops, by the way, guys. Check it out. Look at it. Just look at it. No more plywood countertops. And we just want a little bit of, we're going to saute those pretty good. Because I just want the flavor and the stuffing from that. You don't want the onion? Huh? Yeah. Most people wouldn't put it in there, but I still like the flavor with all of it mixed together. recipe on your stove top. Show them the box. And we're using turkey stove top. You can make your own, but we're doing a quick recipe. And just bring that such I think we got enough apples and cranberries. I think so. What do you think? Quite a bit. Shut it off and fluff it. Hey, it's still gonna be eating this apple. <laughs> um, Why? You wanna do one of them AMSRs? ASMRs. ASMRs. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Hmm. Whatever. 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 Whatever.
Not an easy task. Little birds. Yeah. Would you try a sparrow? No. I'm a blackbird. We can go shoot blackbirds and nope. and eat them for supper. Mm -mm. <laughs> Not doing it. There we go. There's light coming in from every direction. Yeah, it's daylight out. I know. Crazy. A little bit easier, right? The way I cut that one made it to where you could get it in there a little better. Mm -hmm. How long do I have to put these in the oven for? I'm guessing about 40 minutes with the stuffing in there, maybe 35. Libby, you want to come wrap one? Right here. Okay. Don't make your mouth drool. We think Matt Sanders. We you know want to come wrap one? We know you're watching, Matt Sanders. Dad, they need an update on my foot. No, they don't. And then they'll throw up. <laughs> my daughter's got severe poison oak. I have to wrap some around the legs, too. That is done. We are not showing your foot. Show you're going to have to pull that out. So I got a severe yeah. case of chiggers. You may want to pause that for a minute. Okay, we're, you see us wrapping three, one last is wrapping it. I gotta pull this band out. So we're still going. Fire in the hole right there. Then you're gonna hear me go, oh my god, my hands. Probably. Where is the things? In the drawer. Oh. Can you guys tell that he's never in the kitchen? Wow, this is a brand new kitchen. I don't kitchen. even know where it is. Yeah, this is a brand new kitchen. So. Use the poplars. No, I'm gonna use these. Oh, okay. Right now. That's why I kept one old one. <laughs> you gonna have to put the bottom down or just set it on top of here. There you go. Okay. Okay, so I bought, so bought this Ozark Trail Dutch oven. We're gonna start him off, his life off, in the uh, cooking the quail. And I need to get a picture, Eleanor. Hang on, I want to wrap the legs. Okay. I decided to wrap the legs. Cool. Got plenty of bacon. Mm -hmm. Remember you said that I, I should have got like seven packs or something no, like that? No, I didn't think they were going to be big enough. <laughs> or they were going to be too <laughs> big. And then I seen the quail and I said, oh my god. And it's the same size as the last ones. Looks like he's ready for a fight, like a little crab. He's ready for something. Oh my god. <laughs> mm. Sizzling. The heat is staying in. Yeah, if you put them on in there, I'll probably get a picture. That'll be my profile picture. That's pretty cool. So the kitchen's just about back to where it used to be. Look at that. Well, we had some technical difficulties last night, as you guys seen. And some of the lights, when well, my wife's laughing in the background, some of the lights went out, and I don't even know what the video is going to look like. But uh, it's the next day. We're putting them in. They're going in the oven. I guess we call call that soaking in bacon. <laughs> marinating well basically what happened was my pole wiring caught fire out there and killed half of my power and then i was out I had to fly to menards get stuff got home about 10 o'clock and at 1 30 in the morning i finally got power to the house so this is a little delayed that's why i'm wearing something different the wife's no longer around she don't care anymore no she's hiding back that way so cooking and then we're gonna nibble. Mmm, bacon. Give him another 20 minutes and then we'll see. 20 minutes. 
the lid on them though. Oh well. A lot. cranberries but they, they kind of blend in there mm, that sweetness with the and there's no more no more things let's try that well trying right now it's actually the light it was good it's hot oh yeah Bacon wrap leg. Mm. Ain't good. It sucks that it went down like it did. We had to bail out, run up to Council Bluffs, got back late. So we went from like smelling this, it was going to be awesome to Taco Bell at 9.30. <laughs> Basically, it got to marinate a little bit. Tastes like chicken. I mean, hey, you guys need to try the stuffing like this with all the extras in there, apple and whatnot. So good. Pretty dang good. It's a sweet and salty that makes it good. And you can't go wrong with bacon. We're gonna eat and say bye. Oh, no. Bye. She, 
He's like, I don't want to be on camera. <laughs> hey guys, comment down below what you think about these cooking videos. Should we keep them up? Uh, I know I got to do a, a gar one here soon, so stay tuned, guys. <laughs>